Hey everyone and welcome back. Today we are going to be continuing our haunted house journey, a haunted house journey. Every time I say that it feels like we're going to an actual physical haunted yeah. house. But the second in the franchise, I think this is the last one, a haunted house 2 with Marlon Wayans. We just showed Casey the first one this past week and now we're here on the second one. Yes, you all in the comments wanted us to watch this, so here we are. <laughs> we're probably gonna have to blur a lot of stuff again. If it's anything like the first one, which if you haven't seen our first one, go check it out. But I saw that one when it first came out, hadn't seen it since, forgot how raunchy it was, so we had to blur a lot of stuff. I don't remember if this one is as raunchy or not. I do know now because going into the first one, I didn't realize I saw both. I thought that the first one and the second one, that it was the same movie in my head. So that's how little I remember about it. And I thought there was gonna be some Conjuring references. There was none. It was all about paranormal activity. I'm pretty sure, like 100% sure, 99.9999% sure that those references are gonna be in this movie, which I'm excited because Casey's actually seen The Conjuring, the first one, and I feel like she'll get some of those references. What do you remember about The Conjuring? Um, them going to the house, the like demon Sorry. lady, <laughs> the doll, Annabelle. That. Yeah. I, I feel like I, ha I remember it in fragments. Fragments, yeah. It's been a long time and Casey probably blocked that out of her memory because she wasn't very fond of it. So I think you'll probably get some of the references, but I don't know if they're like spoofing like more than just that. It really felt like the first one was strictly paranormal activity. There's probably some other references. Yeah. But predominantly it was that one, which is kind of unlike the scary movie movies. <laughs> that sounded funny. But uh, because it was kind of like an, the Hodge hodgepodge Hodge. of just a random assortment of horror films they made fun of. I think these ones kind of focus more on one. Also, very random, but I looked up like the Rotten Tomatoes score of this movie. And I know Rotten Tomatoes is not something to like be hold into. But typically I like looking at the audience score. I don't really trust critics when it comes to reviews. But I saw Marlon Wayans. I clicked his name and then I saw like a list of all his movies and like literally everything's rotten. <laughs> and audience as well as critic, yeah. which I, I love his movies. I mean, they're not like, you know, they're gonna win Oscars or anything like that, but they're there for a good time. But it's funny that people didn't even like them a lot. You know, even the scary movie, the first two scary movies that he was a part of were both rotten, both by critics and audience, mm. as well as white chicks. I loved White Chicks when I first saw it as a kid. I did too, but I could probably see why people might rate that low for <laughs> certain reasons. I wouldn't rate it low for that reason because yeah. I feel like it's hilarious. Yeah, but... I don't think that the world was as PC back yeah. in uh, 2003, 2004, yeah. whenever that one came out. But they probably just, you know, these types of, they're spoof movies, but White Chicks wasn't, I guess if you want to consider it kind of a spoof movie, it was spoofing, um, what was that one with Paris Hilton? We talked about it recently. Simple oh, Life. Oh, yeah. Simple Life, the, the mm -hmm. reality show. Sort of, kind of. More just, I guess, like, you know, about Paris Hilton, I guess. Um, I think they even... Oh, yeah, I remember it. Oh, my gosh. It was like Miss Wilson. Because it was like, Miss Hilton, you must be worth a <laughs> yeah. million bucks. And then they got off, like, the airplane. And it was like, yeah. Miss Wilson. <laughs> uh, I want to rewatch that. I want to rewatch it, too, now. That just yeah. tells you how good Marlon Wayans is. And the Wayne Brothers in that one. I can understand people maybe not liking this as much because it is very raunchy humor mm. and, like, very kind of, like, suggestive style <laughs> and a lot of people aren't necessarily into that. I've, ta I've talked about this before every freaking movie we watch but like this isn't necessarily my yeah. favorite style of humor but I do understand and appreciate that they are catering to a specific type of humor and that's their style of humor and they do it very well and there are a lot of people who really like this stuff and you know what I mean like they do a good job in what they're trying to do and like they're not trying to do anything else this is they're like they're trying to do this and they're <laughs> doing it you know they know exactly what they're exactly doing. and they're you know what like we're going there <laughs> Car, Ray. Okay, but this bitch heavy as hell, cuz. Ray. Let me finger gang banger at least, huh? Just oh gosh, here we already go. Not even two seconds in. Why are you snuff her fine ass anyway, homie? I wanted a bone, cuz. She was possessed. What? Wait, wait, we're directly continuing? I thought we were gonna like move on. <laughs> possessed like Kanye when you take a picture of just <laughs> what? <laughs> These right here, jaywalking <laughs> for eating grapes in the grocery store without paying for them. <gasps> the worst crime. Driving with my hands off the wheel, cuz. I'm <laughs> ghost riding my whip, cuz. I like doing that shit. Ray Ray is like one of the I'm best parts of these movies. I'm not pissed with my girlfriend. Why, nigga, when you drive it, I'm pissed with Nobody that bitch, huh? <laughs> ah! I've seen you for the bitch that you 
What's she talking about, Hemi? Oh, What's because that? of Tony? Because you remember their night? Oh, <laughs> um, you know, my mind went to real pirates and their booty. You know, no. like. Different I'm type of. I'm gonna get my booty. <laughs> Me booty. <laughs> that ghost got his booty. <laughs> my gosh. Who are you? I'm Forrest Whitaker. I'm ah! booty. <laughs> She breathed in my face, Hammy. Oh no, is he possessed? This is like um the happening. You know the happening? Uh have you ever seen that? No, I haven't. Is that the one with um Zoe De Chanel and Marky Mark? Yes. Okay, I, I know that he was in it. We were never here. I'm with you, Cass. Alright. Is it your car? Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, so is that storyline over? Something bad happened in here. Well, I love it. Uh, and I love it. Is this you. like a new place? A new place, new girl. Uh, Sorry, Malcolm, I can't. Why not? Tony says, <gasps> oh, hell no. I ain't your slave. <laughs> Tony's back. His imaginary friend sound black. <laughs> Progressive. <laughs> <laughs> that game sounds like fun. Oh, well, guys, you know how to pick them, don't you? Here we why go you again. Tony? Maybe Tony's following him. Let's piss off your forefathers. <laughs> <laughs> Come Shiloh Jr. That's my Shiloh Jr. Oh, Shiloh Jr. Don't kill that dog. Well, I was gonna name him Shiloh 2 <laughs> or Shiloh the sequel, but he wouldn't answer to those. So Shiloh the sequel Shiloh is Jr. cute. Shiloh Jr. it is. Hey, hey, you can never have too many cameras, okay? <laughs> hey, Shiloh, come on, baby. Just a he doesn't want to go in. Is it whatever that rope is? What even is that rope? He's trying to warn- <laughs> Oh my god, they killed another dog. What? Why? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> They would. Fuck all my back. <laughs> <laughs> ah! My fucking dog is a. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, don't use that. Oh, it's gonna blow up. It's gonna blow up. It looks like the things from Shrek. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Literally from Shrek. Oh, there he goes again. Wow. Oh my god. And this is like a repeat of the first one. Oh, there he is. No habla español. I just do that when I'm talking to the girl right here. Well, just maybe if you wanted to add us to your route. Are you serious? Dude, I live here, puto. Just assume you got the gloves and the, and the, and the hat and the, the lawnmower. Hey, that's the, the drip. Oh, my name is Miguel Jose Jesus Gonzalez Smith. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, Mexican on my mom's side. Represent! <laughs> I'm Mexican on both sides. Hey, my name is Malcolm, bro. Yeah, I bet your last name is Johnson. See, that's some racist shit, but you're right. <laughs> <laughs> they bonded over racism. Tuesdays, I can cut your grass on Tuesdays. <laughs> what can I say? I'm a gardener by ethnic default. <laughs> <laughs> Be good, negrito. <laughs> Watch out, <laughs> People used to call me that all the time. I liked Wedita. I thought it was cute. Oh, Annabelle! I mean, Ab Abigail! Whoa! How you doing? You ain't gonna say nothing. <laughs> no, you know what he likes to do with inanimate things? Oh, gosh. Here we go again. I can already tell where this is going. <laughs> oh, you Ew, play. this is like worse. Uh, why did I throw up? Uh, why am I getting grossed out? Uh, it's because it's like a creepy... Uh, it looks like it's dirty and... Uh, <laughs> Been through what? several wars and At who knows where it's wars. been. I don't. It's it's dingy. Ugh. Ah. 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 Patreon. Oh my gosh. <laughs> her little shoe. I said her. <laughs> I'm horrified. You gotta go. Mostly because the doll is gross and terrifying. <laughs> Threw her ass in the pool. <laughs> he just fucked it all up. That quality would not be like that. <laughs> Whoa. That was conjuring, I think, yeah. Wait, no. You know what this was this sinister? Oh my gosh! It's Bagul! I forgot about friggin' Sinister. <laughs> Hello? Who is this? Hello? <laughs> what was that? 
Oh, that's an ugly motherfucker. Why does it kind of look like the predator in the face? <laughs> See Tyler! It's I like, it's like cross-eyed. Ah! Ah! No! Keisha! She's the scariest of them all. That thing was watching. But what do you expect after what you did to it? Who the hell is hitting me? Ah! Abigail! You got a page? She has a Facebook! You're She's in a- watching Whoa! Uh-oh. 27,000 views? What? what she's being a clinger. I might have fucked the wrong bitch. <laughs> now she's blowing up my oh cell my phone. Oh my gosh. Look at this. <laughs> it's a bathing suit. She's crazy. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is giving me like freaking Team America vibes. Uh-huh. Perfect. Yeah. And I got the ass too. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is it? What, like, is there that something repressed with you and children's toys? What is going on? Things me your mama do it. There's sometimes she tie my hands and flip me over and toss that salad. Um, Tony likes salad. Anyway. Oh, my oh my gosh. gosh. No. Third clap. What? Oh, I think that was in Conjuring when they were like looking. I Honestly, why? I don't remember several things from that. <laughs> It was a lot scary. But it's also okay because I'm not gonna rewatch that, so yeah, Tony, it's fine. Again. We're good. Yeah, I wanna learn how to start a fire. <laughs> Tony, you're being a bad influence. Oh my gosh. I'm getting scared. I'm like getting scared because I'm getting so scared. Fuck you! This is why I don't watch scary movies! <laughs> why is that scary? You just punched Megan in the fucking face. Oh my god. Why would she do that? Who would do that? Like that? You'll get knocked the fuck out of the time. This is cute. Wear this all day, every day. Oh my gosh, this reminds me of like the mummy with Emotep. Oh god! I feel like this is from that movie I saw, which is very random that I would know the reference. It's like a PG-13 horror movie. <laughs> Fly swatter! <laughs> That'll get him. Eventually. What is that? A nunchuck? <laughs> get mothballs. Mothballs. Okay, give me. What is that? Oh my gosh. <laughs> See now this. <laughs> we just bought one of those. We did. All right. <laughs> Look at the pile. Problem solved. Uh, no, you hit the Uno reverse on that demon. Hey, what you doing? Having a tea party? Oh gosh. Now we gotta deal with this one. Hey, don't sit there. That's Tony's seat. Fuck Tony. Oh, sorry. My bad, Tony. <laughs> Tony says no problem. Biatch. <laughs> Why does Tony seem cool? <laughs> what the? That's straight vodka. What? Tony calls it tea. Oh, no. She drinks a lot uh, of tea. <laughs> Oh, my gosh. Is this from Abigail? This oh, my, my God. God. She has the mark uh, on the crown. Miss me? How's what making? Are you fucking crazy? I take. <laughs> it's not you. It's me. Don't play oh fucking innocent with me. You know I had a girl. Oh man. I'm selfish right now. I would love to have you and Megan. Oh. And, and be honest with you, my stuffed animal. No oh, <laughs> man. Oh, <fuck>. no. <laughs> you see what you made me do? <laughs> Only you do this to me. Oh, hit a bit. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> There's the potty humor that Casey hates. It's spicy going in, but it's twice as spicy going out. That's scientifically impossible. I smell you in here. It's the noises, the noises. Tonight you drown. <laughs> what is that? Oh, they like strapped him to the chair? Oh my god. Ah, they're floating. <laughs> Somebody doesn't know science. Ooh, perfectly good leather jacket. Huh? I'm gonna push him down. Oh, they got. Are they gonna go? Oh. This isn't over. 
Oh, they gotta stop making scary movies without the way. Meta as oh, fuck! <laughs> Except I like the third one. I just immediately hit the box. Was that blood? It looked like it, right? Oh, uh, what I what feel like it's it? a new dog or something. I know, I feel like it was a dog. <laughs> It was a dog. You were so upset. Oh was my Shiloh gosh. Jr. It was Shiloh the third. What puppy gets delivered at this time of night? Oh, no. Oh, it had a fool. Fucking crazy. Yeah, she's still holding her damn box. Take him out of the Oh my god. Crazy dog keep my car. <laughs> bro, somebody fuck your car. Yeah. You wouldn't know anybody with an auto body shop, would you? Are you serious, bro? Oh, you think we all have low riders with a bunch of primal over it? With a Watch him have one. one. I think I have like six kids. Bro, he has all this. Uh, they chase chihuahuas and make burritos. Is that what you <laughs> do? And I just want my fucking car fixed. I <laughs> just fucking <Yeah. me. laughs> Man, I got a cousin. His name is Chucho. <laughs> <laughs> For a haunting? <laughs> oh, it's oh, fucking Keisha! Oh, what's up with that? Oh, well, yeah, she doesn't you know, know. the boyfriend that I told you abandoned me and left me in a ditch Oh my die. god! Technically, you were in a car. Tim. Don't over-dramatize it. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> I think I'll let you two have Oh, it. Keisha. Stirring stuff up. And Malcolm, it was great seeing you. Oh! <laughs> First of all, she was verbally abusive. <laughs> Baby, what's for dinner? Eat some of this pussy, you fucking fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't all bad. Uh-oh. No, 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 no
<laughs> oh gosh, we know what happened last time. Y'all got confrontational. I'm sending you back to Taiwan. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna be back. Are you gonna make me violent? Come Burn on, it. You fuck over here. Shut up. Oh shit. She's gonna come back completely put together. That bitch. See you right in now. <laughs> oh, we're about to have a barbecue. Oh, whoa. Hey, you said it. Burn her. fucking burn today, baby. <laughs> it's like so unsafe when you put gasoline oh, everywhere. Oh no. Is her little smoky little ghost self? No. Oh. Oh my gosh! We got a call about a domestic dispute. Are you Malcolm Johnson? <laughs> With Abigail? <laughs> I don't think I, my phone is broken. I know what this is. Did you call? It's the dog! It's the dog! Oh! It's the dog. It's the dog. Oh, with it bruised! It was this dog. I was fucking this dog. He's on PCP. Oh, PCP! No, no, oh, no, 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 oh my god! <laughs> You're right on it, you idiot. Oh, this is literally what I was complaining yeah. about with him earlier. Oh, man. You're gonna ruin a perfectly other good leather jacket. <laughs> You're really bad at your job. Oh, there goes the second bottle. Oh, shit, okay. Oh, my Whoa. God. Whoa. Wow, that's <laughs> escalating. All at the same time, you're dead, bro. Malcolm? Ew! You look fucked up. puking like a little bitch. What? Ew, I keep thinking about it. Is this the dad from Even Stevens? Yeah. Victims have also been known to break their own bones during the possession. True. That happened to me. I was first in prison. I was trying to get myself head, right? <laughs> Which Manson was that rumor of that? Marilyn. Marilyn Manson. Everybody How knows that rumor. Was that like the rumor of your every, elementary like, school? Every child which Hood. is very weird. I know, that, but every, I knew that in elementary I school. I did too. Why did we all know that? Who was telling and us And there was that? such bullshit. Who, and that was like, who told us that? That was before the internet too. Why really? did we all know that? Why did we all think that Marilyn Manson took out two ribs so that he could, you know, do his own, you know, what? Salad. <laughs> no, that's the wrong thing. That's the butthole. <laughs> Oh. We completely missed this scene. He literally just killed someone. Oh, hey. I'm sorry, I don't have, no, that's the only one I had. Oh. <laughs> I used to have two shanks, but I don't keep that anymore. I stopped doing two shanks. Uh -huh. It was a thing, and everybody was like, two shanks. <laughs> what? Two shanks? I haven't been staying steady on my demon fighting skills, is what I'm trying to tell you. How so, is his delivery just so... <laughs> day after day. <laughs> I forgot what they used to call him, like him and a few other people. It was like the Godfathers of Comedy. <laughs> he just like he's just so like the Kardashian. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, did you see him? It's the crazy mama, it's Kim, Chloe, Courtney, Critty, the two little ones. Yeah. They ain't gonna be free. <laughs> Kendall and Kylie? <laughs> Rob Fat and the motherfucker. Oh. Bruce. Oh, the Bruce. What the fuck is wrong with Bruce? Oh, well. This was before. Was yeah, now it's like, Caitlin. He don't look like the nigga that was on the weedy <laughs> That's true. Well, <laughs> <laughs> this movie was somehow early and late at the same time. Thank you. Are these like some of the Warrens? It's funny because I can tell by his hairstyle. Even your name comes first on our book cover, and I am the one with the gift. Ned comes before Noreen in alphabetical order. We say our names first too, so people don't confuse us with Casey Anthony. This is a very common thing that we have to do when we meet new people. It's Anthony Casey. Like every time we have to say the same exact thing. It's not the house that's haunted. Uh, it's him. I knew it. I knew it. It's always the little white girl. No, Everybody. it's you. Exorcist. Sism of Emily Rose, all white right, girls. <laughs> Cause ain't no black parents gonna have no white girl talking like that. There was something attached to you. Oh, that was a hemorrhoid. <laughs> <laughs> Your family hey, could have left here at any time. Yeah, I know, he's yeah. the one who's haunted. Well, no, that's bullshit though, because what about Tony? What about the box? That's what true. about Abigail? Why are you trying to make into a chair? Because the bitch got a demon. <laughs> Do you not see her? This is, this is some scary kukui shit, right? Kukui! Kukui is like ghetto Mexican boogie. <laughs> it's like ghetto! Like George Lopez. <laughs> That bitch don't look right. Oh, why you gotta call that bitch? You're disrespecting the little hoe. <laughs> <laughs> I 
There's certain words that trigger white folks. I mean, bitch, hoe. <laughs> just called her hoe. You can't say those words. That's like our name. <laughs> Say it at a bus and walk. Oh my gosh. They're in the parking lot of a KFC, but yeah, we'll say it. Yeah, Whoa. <laughs> Literally, Cedric the Entertainer is like so funny. Is this like the first time you've seen him? Yeah, I've oh never seen him before. I He's more, hilarious. I got more shit to show you. He's so free. Like, he, like the delivery. Okay, real quick, drop some comments down below. Let us know your favorite Cedric the Entertainer movie. Yeah, I want to see more. He's hilarious. But y'all thought I was going to shoot this bitch? I'm go, just going to pistol whip her. No. <laughs> she weakens? <laughs> your daughter is possessed. I need, I need three other white people. Pain man. Pain man. Pain man. Pain it's something in my head is telling me to blow off my head. <laughs> is it this head? Is it this head? <laughs> it's not in there. Demon break. Who wants a mojito? <laughs> what? Oh, the black guy still got a gun. Oh, God. <laughs> Who wants a mojito? I don't get Ryan Seacrest. Oh, Ryan Seacrest. I know what it is because I dressed up as a foreclosure side where people was getting kicked out of their house. <laughs> Halloween. Oh, my God. I know it was wrong, but it was funny to me. <laughs> he has a message for you. He says, No! Oh! Doug. Doug, what? Doug? Whoa. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, we got a full inversion. We got a full inversion. Oh my gosh. She had bunny slippers. Oh, for you or for them? <laughs> Why is she doing like the, the Black Widow pose? <laughs> What? <laughs> Go get him, buddy. Oh, what are you doing, are child? You okay? Yeah, but Becky, she looks pretty fucked up. <laughs> I got scared again. Was he just watching TV? <laughs> oh my yeah. god. You heard the man, the bitch is his. I tried. Please help me, I'm so Whoa. sorry. <sighs> Becky will. Oh my god. god. The bitch is confused. <laughs> Demon scream for a while. I think it's safe to go back up there. I still have a bad feeling. For God's sake, come on! she playing guys. Sudoku. They're cuddling. The demon's gone. I did it. I think he's possessed. That's <laughs> the face that he makes when he has an orgasm. I think he's okay, you guys. Ah! Yes, we're watching it, dummy. Sounds like a chocolate pretzel. <laughs> this is flexibility and the dexterity. I think he can suck his own dick. No, Why don't we keep going back to that? Oh. Ah! Oh, Marilyn Manson. <laughs> Sure. Double tap. I gotta get the hell out of here. Once they see a black guy in a pool of blood, you know who they're gonna come after next. <laughs> <laughs> they watch you. Thank you guys so much. No well. need to thank us. We're happy to help. The doll. And we'll just take Abigail with thank us as well for safekeeping. Oh okay. my gosh. So I'm a professional. She's a freak. Stop oh my God. Hey, look at my thing picking up on the vibes. You know how when you're trying to last longer, you think about baseball? Mm -hmm. It's kind of like that. Throws a haze in their head. It's the only way to survive when you're married to a psychic. <laughs> Come on, Ned. I know you're thinking about fucking that doll. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so we've had enough. <laughs> I bet it's Keisha. I was like trying to like wrap up all this like, you know, loose ends in my head. My, my nigga senses is tingling. <laughs> Spidey senses. Uh, would you hush? My white senses say we're fine. <laughs> well. Okay, I'm dripping. It's always the camera. Ah, Ray Ray. Ray Ray. You already know how it's going down, motherfucker. You should have been in the movie more. What's up, my nigga? I'm here, Ken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no. What you doing, man? I got to make bearings together, homie. Shut <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, shit. Megan got fucked ah. up. Oh, my gosh. Wow. I'm fucking dead. They done killed a little mini white bitch, too, cuz. Fuck. 
cap and down. That's him, but that's his shoe. I see a converse. Shit. It's another dead body, cuz. That's him. <laughs> they don't kill my cuz, cuz. <laughs> it's like boys in the hood. He's supposed to go to college. Why the fuck they let Doughboy live? And Ricky dead. I think we just got spoiled for boys. Oh no, we haven't seen it. See, this nigga got some money though. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> what about Wyatt? World star. Yeah. World, yeah, world star. World star. <laughs> that was a big thing then too. Keisha, nigga, that shit, nigga, that bitch is gangster. <laughs> That came down to the basement on some creep shit like don't don't don't. That was sitting here. Then waiting. you played dead. I let my sneakers be home, so she'd be like, "Oh, that nigga dead." That's yeah, he was just that's playing that's dead. Why some of that can't kill me? I'm like a roach. Oh, uh, she's gonna fuck up. Oh my gosh, up. she's gonna show up. Is she oh, out? there she yeah. is. There she is. She's right behind me, isn't she? Just like the first one. <laughs> So, A uh, Haunted House 2, uh, which one did you like more? The first one. The first one? Yeah. I think, I don't know, there was a lot of moments in this one, specifically with Abigail. You know, yeah. I think Abigail yeah. was like the part that I remembered the most. I just, in my head, remembered vividly, this is gonna sound funny, and this is what I thought we were going into in the first movie, was her sending the selfies in the bikini. Mm -hmm. I remembered that, like, so vividly. That part was, that, yeah. I said fart. <laughs> hey, fart joke, <laughs> spook movie. That part was funny, yeah. yes. I don't know, I think, like, the first one I feel like was just a little bit better for me. I think also having Keisha involved because yeah. In this one, Megan didn't really contribute that much to the humor. She was kind of there. Like, but in the in the first one, Keisha like did a lot of funny stuff as yeah, well. Yeah. Like, she was like really funny. You could tell. Also, I think I appreciate in this one though that she was still a part of it in yeah. some way, even though she wasn't like a main part. And then she was still like the overarching villain of both yeah. movies. That yeah. sounds funny to say, <laughs> but like she was the one who came back there at the end and like finished off his new girl. Yeah. And the kids. Well, we didn't see Wyatt die, but you know, maybe he's out there with Tony. I do feel like after this movie, I'm like reaching my limit on these raunchy movies that I want to take a break because it's a lot. It's yeah. a lot. There's there was a lot. <laughs> like, oh my god. Which one had more? This one or the first one? Maybe the first one. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they're comparable. They're kind of comparable. It's like some the scenes though they go on for a really long time. It's yeah, like, like his sex scene with I know, Abigail. Oh God. <laughs> but that was like the one with the freaking doll, like the well the other dolls. Yeah. But now I, I feel like this one was more. I don't know. Maybe because she was kind of humanoid. Like <laughs> just because of that. I don't know. It just was like I mean they were there was both. some Abigail nudity in this oh, one. Man. <laughs> Goodness gracious. She was like pulling her bikini this way. <laughs> Yeah, I, th I feel like the first one was like way better. I don't know. I like this opinion. one too. Um, In my opinion, I liked uh, freaking uh, e Gabriel Iglesias' yeah, role in this funny. one too. I like how they bonded over racism. I thought that was pretty <laughs> funny. Um, yeah, but I guess. In my head, I just kind of remember the conjuring. There were some things I forgot, but I remember the conjuring more, I think, vividly, just because I think it's newer. And I probably, I feel like I saw Paranormal Activity once, but I've seen the conjuring multiple times. So I guess like those references were funny. I completely forgot that they referenced Sinister in this movie, but that was like the whole, I forgot what they called it, but in Sinister, it was uh, Bagul, if I'm not mistaken, which, this is neither here nor there. I guess it is kind of here and there. But I saw a list of like the scariest movies of all time and Sinister was on it. And I don't really remember it being super scary. In my head, it kind of gets lost with a lot of other horror movies of that era. It was like between the era of 2010 to maybe 2015. Um, there, I just remember a lot of horror movies coming out that I think I talked about this in the first one, like the jump scare movies. That one, it wasn't as jump scary as me, to me, but I think I, I don't know, I just, Ethan Hawke was in it. Hmm. He was like the main guy. And and for some reason, I just don't remember it being as scary as all that. Like, you know, the way people have made it out to be after the fact. Let me ask you this. What's hmm. the scariest movie you ever saw? Oh man, that's an interesting question. So I remember, at, like this is weird to say this as an adult, Conjuring was pretty scary the first time I saw it. Conjuring 2. I remember having nightmares of the damn nun from Conjuring 2, which I know you haven't seen Conjuring 2, but I know you've seen The Nun because they mm -hmm. made spin offs called, I think, The Nun. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if that lasted so long. The Exorcist was scary to me, even though I never saw it. 
like that girl's face was like embedded in my like when I would like have nightmares at night as a child that's the face I would <laughs> see but this is ironic enough and it's probably it probably wouldn't scare me now but there was a movie based off of a Stephen King book called Pet Cemetery, hmm. the original Pet Cemetery that I, I did see as a kid. And I don't remember a lot of it now because I was a kid, but it scared the shit out of me. And I remember that movie scaring me a lot as well too. I don't know if it, it's like kind of corny and maybe it's just my childhood mind, like remembering things that were like more scary that if I came back today and I saw it now, it probably yeah. wouldn't be as scary. I do need to rewatch that because I, I, I wouldn't be scared by it now. There's not much that can scare me now. It's weird to say that. What's the scariest movie you ever saw? Oh my god, that's like a really hard question. You threw this shit on me! I know, but like I haven't seen a lot of scary movies. So which one have you seen? I, sh Casey? Okay, she was scared by The Conjuring. She told me she had nightmares for like two weeks. But the first time when me and Casey were first dating, I saw this meme. It wasn't a meme. It's not a meme because it wasn't funny. But I saw it like on Twitter or, or uh. Instagram or something. I forgot what was like the thing back in the day when we started dating in like 2015, 2016, yeah. one of the two. And it was like, okay, what would you do? That was like the premise of this like a little short form content. And it was the, I forgot if it was the husband or the wife that were, they were, they were both laying in bed. And they were like, hey, honey, honey, honey. And then it cut to like whoever the opposite was. And it was like a freaking like scary ass yeah. freaking face. And I was like, oh shit. I saw that on my phone. I was like, oh shit. And then I showed Casey. We're both laying in bed and I showed it to you. And you're like, oh, why would you show me that? I was like, okay, Casey's a scary cat. And that's how I learned. <laughs> I feel like I don't, it's hard for me to say as an adult because like I just don't really know. But also I just don't watch a lot of scary stuff now on purpose. Mm. But I feel like as a kid, I saw the movie Jeepers Creepers. And I was terrified. You should watch it again but as an I, adult. But I did watch The Exorcist as a kid and I was very scared. So I we had, have that in common. And Children of the Corn. I never saw that one. I was, those were like, they came on, it was like a TV cut. I feel like because they came on TV like back to back was during it like. ABC's 31 Days yes, of Horror? It was that. It was like the like, whatever the 30 Days of Halloween, like yeah, they would yeah, play yeah. movies. It was that because they they came on like it was either like a day or two apart or like you after know what's each funny other. About those ones, I, was like, I bet they were severely censored. Probably, but I was terrified. So yeah. maybe those. I, I just remember Jeepers Creepers. Spoilers, spoilers. Him like having his eyes out at the end and like that. I, I don't remember it as much. No, I saw it. I, so. That like was burned in my mind. It's got a um, freaking uh, Justin Long. Is it even that scary though? Probably not. That's what I'm saying. You should probably watch it now. Eh. Watching our childhood scary movies and oh see if they gosh, still scare us. That would be a good I, video. We can watch Pet Cemetery. You can watch Jeepers, Jeepers Creepers. Creepers. Not The Exorcist. Fuck that movie. No way. <laughs> Jeepers Creepers, I will allow. Low key, I'm not really... Casey kind of made me... Not made me. That's weird to say. But she never really liked possession movies. And then I kind of had saw them, but I never really thought much of them. But now I really don't like possession movies either. So like I probably wouldn't actively go watch it. Hereditary was a movie we watched, which I won't say I'm scared by that movie. It's just fucking disgusting. Yeah. I hate it. I'm like that's a, a stupid fucking movie. A lot of people I will, like that. I will. I, I will constantly talk shit about that movie. Like because also you know that one really... made me feel weird for a long time after that. But that not movie, from fear. It was. Just... I was angry at that yeah. movie. I was like, cause you know, the spoilers go away if you don't want to hear it. I'm not going to go into super deep spoilers, but before that movie revealed what it was actually about, I was like, I was going, Hey, I was disgusted a little bit, yeah, but I was also like, was what's, the, what's, the, what's the twist of this movie? And then when the twist happened in the movie, I'm like, that's what you sat here and maybe watch two hours of this stupid satanic bullshit. And that's what you gave me. I hated it. I hated it. I'm sorry. I hated that movie. If you like that movie, shame on you. But a movie that I do like that's a horror film, kind of creepy, but in a good way, it follows. Yeah. That's a movie I feel like, you know what? I don't think it's as like out of the mainstream now because I feel like it's kind of hipster to like it. Like they even referenced it in Scary Movie 6 or mm -hmm. 7, the one with uh, Jenna Ortega. I think that was like you what she was- scream? What did I say? Scary mm -hmm. movie? Uh, scream. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> So many spoof movies in my mind right now. <laughs> but in Scream 6 or 7, they said like, oh, scary, well, what scary movie do you like or whatever? Yeah. And she was like listing off a whole bunch of movies. And It Follows was a part, also hereditary. And she said Baba that. Duke. I've never seen that one. She said that was like, the like I think the favorite one. Really? I've never seen that Is either. Baba Duke scary? Let us know in the comments. 
I feel like we're just I'm like, not saying we're watching it. We're just having a little podcast about horror. Yeah. These movies did introduce me to Cedric the Entertainer, which yeah. is kind of funny, but like his delivery of scenes and lines were just like so good. Like I feel like it's very difficult to have good comedic timing. Like it, it takes a lot of talent. And I mean a lot of people do have it, He's obviously. Pretty but like he like it was just so fluid and well done, and it makes me want to watch more stuff with him. He has been around for a long time. Yeah. I feel I feel like me because I'm there's like a six-year age gap between me and Casey I'm six years older and I remember movies with Cedric the Entertainer but I don't remember he was like a big stand-up comedian if I'm not mistaken and there were things I definitely saw him in but I feel like he was kind of going into his like Ice Cube like mm. era mm -hmm. where, and when I say yeah. Ice Cube I'm talking about like where uh, are we there yet yeah, stuff like yeah. that like I saw him in a movie that I was like kind that of movie. similar <laughs> are we there yeah, yet I like it. similar to um like uh, the vacation movies I think it was called the, the Johnson Family mm -hmm. Vacation and he was on a lot of other stuff like that but I know he's more famous for more shit than that like that is just like what's in my head and I'm pretty sure him and like maybe three other comedians were considered like the the godfathers of comedy and I think that might have been like the name of a comedy special or something like that so I know he's very very famous he's probably just older now obviously he's older now so like he's probably in not as much stuff as I remember I don't see him in like the mainstream anymore so I bet he has some pretty popular stuff out there so let us know in the comments what are his most popular things so that we could check them out whether they're on the channel or off the channel all right well thank y'all so much for watching and we will see you next time <laughs>